lot bigger exterior here. And today we're uh, just doing some dicking around. I bought this GoPro battery and I thought it was gonna be the next invention of a fucking lifetime and ooh my ahs and ah my oohs and you know all that crap. But I uh, ended up like almost wanting to look like breaking my camera so I'm returning that shit at best cut right now. Ooh I like cool days where it's a little chilly out because the ground feels a little more peppy. I'm like... <laughs> so I've been seeing a lot of uh, talk about YouTube ads and like YouTube dicking out a lot of people and you know now that even H3H3 H3 kind of made a full-blown goodbye YouTube style video I feel like uh, maybe I should finally chime in on that and answer the peeps that's been asking. So I guess YouTube you know the, it's, it's nothing new no new news here so I ain't gonna be telling anything you haven't heard I guess like as, as far as the YouTube boycotts and shit and how I guess you know a bunch of advertisers pulled out and now no one's making shit on YouTube and yeah I guess that's true. Um, I've noticed like my YouTube's been making, I guess, like, fucking 30% of what it normally has been. So, yeah, I, I've actually even noticed it down on my level. Even I think every YouTuber on there is. And, you know, it's kind of unfortunate for the guys that are that are lower based, you know, that, that are just starting out, you know, and, you know, maybe wanting to monetize their shit and buy themselves some new camera gear or, you know, use the monetization money to work on their bike. There's nothing wrong with fucking showing ads shit youtube's gonna show ads anyway it's just like twitch you go on twitch you're gonna get an ad that supports twitch if the guy's not partnered with twitch or the guy can be partnered and you'll you'll be supporting him so you know either way and uh, yeah for those guys it's really gonna uh, dick them down hard and you know me just the way i am and how i talk i feel like you know <laughs> i'm probably i'm probably the channel that no one wants to fucking be on and you know Shitty, shittily for uh, for me, but I guess good for them. Uh, I don't care. I'm not gonna fucking change the way I am. I'm not gonna change how I do videos or any of that shit. Damn, that looks like a jump right there. You could jump that fucking door. Yeah. In case you guys don't know, I've been doing YouTube before fucking money was even a thing involved with this shit. So, but I'll be cool. I'm gonna keep making my videos or not. I'm not gonna fucking pull out of YouTube or anything. One of my uh, favorite channels, ETC. They uh they did something cool where they were like they threw their videos on Twitch because I guess on Twitch oh fuck you can throw your shit on there or whatever you know maybe if it comes down to it I might come try that out. <laughs> Damn code enforcement going strong. They're like I need to go ahead and write all kinds of citations over this boat. It was like a police presence to a shooting, but for like a citation. Like it was like a broke down boat on the side of the road. They're like, code four, code four. I need two fucking two backup code enforcement officers. Stat, please. I need assistance ASAP. Code enforcement down. Code enforcement down. Can you imagine me having to like filter my shit out, filtering out curse words and how stupid that would sound? You'd just be hearing beeps and boops and fucking. I pretty much sound like this right here. Beep, boop, pop, beep, beep. So, you know, I don't think any of you guys want to see any videos where I'm sounding like that the whole video. <laughs> no, I was kidding, but yeah, I ain't, I ain't fucking... I ain't dicking myself, you know. Shit will roll around, shit always seems to work out in the long run, and, you know, we'll see how everything turns out. But, on other news... Damn, it's been lonely playing some video games the past few days. Arson Rise has been in fucking New York recently, and, like, every time I... Every time I hop on my uh, Steam to go play some video games, I see Arson offline and I'm like, oh yeah, he's in New York, and then all of a sudden I'm like, I really miss my nigga. I really miss my nigga. White people, you can sing it too, just change that into a W. Miss my wigger. But yeah, speaking of video games, I've, uh, been bringing the Twitch back tough. Been streaming the new Outlast 2. That game is tight. 
man i never i never had more requests for a game than playing outlast because i used to on my old gaming channel when i had the time to fucking do all my gaming videos and shit i played outlast one and to this day people bring that up and that was like 2015 so you know in love to those people i went ahead and got outlast dude and we started that guy up and i can't lie that game is pretty damn tight and scary but those games can get so stressful you just you'll you'll, you'll just be like right in front of a motherfucker getting chased and the sounds you're just like Queef. oh fuck it stinks it literally smells like a, a big ass piece of shit with a condom over it that was in a fucking horse's ass Oh man, I forgot it's business hours today because it's the week. I go over with one wheel. I went to the hospital bed. I said, dickhead, are you dead? Go ahead and cross. My coochie hole is rust. There's actually like some random little body of water here in between all these buildings with fucking like geese and shit in it. Can you believe that? Look at this. Look at this. Look at this beautiful structure of water with the ducks just chilling, quack quacking in their goodies. <laughs> yeah. Be great for this light to turn uh, green any day now. Six and a half hours later. What the fuck? Didn't even register my ass. Best twat, get your steel does with drill does attachments. Your attachment with drill does here today. Zoom, zoom, a splishity splash, a and a. A few moments later. Yeah. After you, Belvedere. Holy shit, I think I want five guys. And by five guys, I don't mean like five guys' buttholes and my fucking pecker. Yeah. A few moments later. Yeah. Man, five guys is flames. I gotta even say, man, this shit's better than fucking like in and out I know in and out has got a lot of hater, hater, mushroom tip potatoes, but uh, fucking shit is flame status, dog. Where San Bernardino's got like the most random mundane shit. We had Route 66 until our city couldn't afford it anymore. Then we have like fucking cannabis cup. Then we have like that EDC shit out here sometimes. These poor guys in here. Having to walk around and pick up everyone's fucking blunt wrappers and roaches and, and joint clips and mushroom tips and cooter hips and all that good stuff. Four twenty hub, damn dog. Oh, there come Kawasexis there. Damn, my old little playground from when I was a fucking kid. I used to play in this church playground all the time. Bring my little fucking skateboard. Oh, I put rails all in there so no one could sleep in there. All the homeless people would come here and sleep. And even the church is like, nah, dog. We're going to go ahead and cut you guys out. 
Yep, this was my old neighborhood I grew up in when I was a kid. For about quite a few years, actually. I lived right there, number nine, up there in the top. Damn, my friend's parents still live here. This is their truck right here, the Suburban. Man, this place has changed. Ah! <laughs> I can faked out, broke the ankles of that little dog. Not a queef given. Isn't that a dope ass house? Like someone went out of their way to make that shit look cool like that, like some fairy tale fucking Wizard of Cock house. Damn, I've ridden like 30 miles on this tank already and I'm still at a complete full tank. That's some gas mileage right there, home dog. Damn, ain't no one here. Perfect timing. Yeah. Let's check that good old P.O. Cax. Little package check for you guys if you guys sent this. I got this. Perfect fit. Yeah, guys, feel free to send me anything in my P.O. box. It's always open. Always got the address down below in the description on all my videos. <laughs> Be featured in a mail call video. Well, guys, it's gonna go and conclude this little dick off episode. Got a new Megusta Reaper shirt available. Go ahead, pick that baby up down below if you guys want one. Um, as always, got my two brothers' exhaust, keychains, blah, 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 blah. My fucking merch down below in the description. And as always, if you enjoyed the video, don't forget to hit the... Fuck! Out of that like button, you guys have a real good day. I'll see you guys later.